standing here drinking an old fashioned with uh, Nathaniel Davis from Drinkworks, who uh, appears to have some way to make alcohol because you've made me a drink. Yes, indeed. Yeah, this is the um, Drinkworks Home Bar by Keurig. So, Drinkworks is a joint venture between Keurig Dr. Pepper and Anheuser Busch. So, think about it as the intersection between appliances and technology and the alcohol beverage space. I'm a fan of both, so that works out. As am I. It's uh, it's it's a pleasure to do this uh, every day, and we've had a great CES. So basically, you know the Keurig model. One pod, one button, one drink. We've just applied that to cocktails. So think about this as cocktails by Keurig. Okay, so what we're looking at, this is audio and video, by the way, so I'll be describing more for the audio people. Okay. It, uh, it looks sort of like a Keurig... Uh, hanging out with some other electronic friends here. What do we got? How does this work? Sure, so um, it's an appliance um, that has, obviously we've got the pods which contain our, our cocktail concentrate in this case. We source premium spirits, but we do it at the still or barrel strength before it's cut with water, so it's in very concentrated form. And what the machine does, all the user has to do is load it with water, just like a it's my coffee, coffee like my machine. Curry. It pulls it inside and chills it down in an internal water tank and then circulates nearly at freezing and then holds it there ready to make many, many cocktails when you come home from work or if you have a dinner party or whatever. Or for breakfast, you know, depending on how you roll. It's you know. got, exactly, exactly. I'm not judging. Um, it's got a small CO2 uh, tank for carbonated beverages as well. Oh, wow. So okay. here's the thing. On the back of each pod is a barcode which says to the machine, I am a Moscow Mule in this case, and this is my recipe of how to make me. Okay. And this is real vodka, real lime juice, and real ginger beer inside, but concentrated at the still level, you e said. Exactly right. So it's, so it's pulled out. It's super test, uh, high proof uh, vodka. Uh, which we make ourselves. We're a distillery, a winery, and a brewery, and we manage manage all three. We do the development uh, in-house. You, He's dropping the pod in. He drops it's, the pod in. It, it looks like a fancy version of a Keurig. It's got blue lights. It's it's all shiny and everything. Well, you know, we designed this thing which needs to be, obviously, Keurig is such a wonderful and powerful brand that people trust and know in their coffee. But we're both elevating the experience and taking it into a more adult context, sure, which sure. needs to be both. It's not kitchen, it's fancy. It's It can be kitchen. It can also be home bar. It can be man cave or but whatever. it's fancy. And it's fancy. And it's fancy. <laughs> so when you close, when you close it it'll recognize it just said authentic authenticated pod so it actually sees our quality trust mark knows that we made it and it unlocks the system it says whether or not it needs ice what size of glass to use little nudge on Please things medium like glass year. oh I wish that your your coffee maker told me what size cup it's well, got little pictures and I sit there going I don't know which one's which we also like to nudge people to make sure that they're enjoying you know garnishing and presenting in the best way possible so Moscow mule just for here at CES, we're distributing hundreds and hundreds of samplers, so I've got it in a shaker. But typically, of course, this would go in a copper mug with crushed ice. But it's flashing and copper saying... Copper mug. Of course. It's flashing blue and saying, please press me. So we'll go ahead and hit the button. What's happening now is it's pulling the chilled water into its blast carbonation chamber inside. We'll actually hear it. It's quite noisy here, and you won't quite hear it. Uh, heating it with high-pressure CO2 to Tell me it's carbonate I'll the water. Move the microphone. There it goes, and it's about to. Ooh, that's satisfying. That's right. The the satisfying whoosh so now it's of carbonation. the drink, and now it. Cracks the pot. Got to get all the audio in here. Of course. And it tops up in this case. So we make everything from from short, um, very strong old fashions, Cosmopolitans, uh, our tequila forward margarita, all the way up to a larger eight ounce carbonated Moscow Mule and other bubbly cocktails. We've got a wine collection that we call Wandering Vine, where people said, oh, I love your complex cocktails, but give me a glass of wine for Monday or Tuesday. So we've got a rosé spritzer, uh, a Prosecco inspired lemon bubbly with a limoncello uh, uh, liqueur uh, oh, added in there and on and on. We've got 25 and counting, 29 cocktails, Cocktails at certain seasons of the year, huge variety, just to make complex cocktails as easy as a push of a button. So I'm noticing. So this is a, uh, a long cylindrical tube, and it says it's got four liquid pods. So that makes me four drinks out of each of these. That's right. And you can keep these for a while. 
Yeah, these are the, the they're good for between nine and, and 12 months, but they shouldn't last that long in anybody's uh, <laughs> kitchen normally. But really what people are saying is it's the freshness of preparing it on demand and seeing it being made right in front of your eyes that really gives you the impact of uh, uh, that people are looking for when they're hosting. This really does look interesting. So uh, Drinkworks by Keurig, uh, what's the, when is this going to be available? It's available now depending on where you are. So And we're rolling out and expanding. So we're in Missouri, Florida, California, New York, Pennsylvania, Illinois, uh, Europe, New Zealand, no, not yet. Australia. So we're we're, we're India st sticking with the U.S. right now with our uh, Vermont manufacturing base for the for the distillery, and we're continuing to roll out. So if you go to Drinkworks.com, we're constantly updating. You give your uh, email address, and we'll keep you apprised if you're outside of that footprint. Otherwise, you can buy online, including the alcoholic pods, which we can ship to your home. Oh, you can. Or you can find them at Walmart.com, Best Buy.com, or in stores such as Total Wine, ABC, uh, oh, wow. uh, BJ's, Binnie's, so on and so forth. So we're in large alcohol. Uh, uh, retailers, premium retailers that can also service the system, and we're in big box retailers that are just doing the appliance, and we're online for all of those things. Wow, that's great. And what's your price point on the Drinkworks by Curie? Um, $2.99 MSRP right now. Really? Yeah. Wow. I thought it was going to be a lot more than that. And uh, how about these pods? The pods are typically retailing. Our suggestion is uh, fifteen ninety nine for four, but it depends a little bit on the market where you where you. Fifteen ninety nine, so yeah. sixteen bucks for four. Sixteen bucks for four, so four, four bucks a drink, which is uh, a bargain compared to my local cocktail lounge for sure. And I considering, so. if you look around the entire, uh, if you look across the portfolio, it would cost about five or maybe seven hundred bucks to stock up your home bar with all the ingredients that we provide in our in our portfolio. I so paid that really four times you. that for a bowl of oatmeal this morning at. Yes. <laughs> that's, that's right. That's true. <laughs> All right. Thank you very much, Nathaniel. This is very cool. Appreciate your time. It's a real pleasure. Thanks.